Hi Pisces, this is you versus them for the 12th through the 18th. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. All right, guys, what's been going on for Pisces? I feel like you guys are trying to find your way. Okay. And I think you're at the point where you're wanting to settle down, but you're looking for the right person. Okay. Is this person the right person? Well, let's take a look at this and see. But what I do know is that if they're not, uh, you're not doing anything because you know exactly what you want here. You have a confidence in your, within yourself to not accept things that you feel like you don't need to, okay, at this point. Um, Aries energy is right there, Virgo here. Let's see what your person has been dealing with, what they have been going through. What's been going on with Pisces person here? The magician. Somebody's trying to make some shit happen with you, I feel. And um, they're confident that they can. Okay? At least they were before. And I feel like what they're doing right now is um, they're in the planning stages. Trying to figure out how they can swim you. How they can win you back. Okay, with that Knight of Pentacles under their Taurus energy. Virgo energy here. Um... Gemini, for some of you, and Scorpio is what I'm getting here, okay? Hmm, all right. Let's see. What is keeping you from this person? Why are you not connecting with this person? Why? Consciously is Pisces not connected with this person? Hmm. Some of you guys feel like you there are better options out there for you. Okay. Um, you're not sure if they are the one. Some of you feel like this person has been um, maybe cheating on you or has been dating. Um, just kind of playing the field even. But for most of you, you're not sure if they're the one for you. Okay. That's the bottom line. It's like that's why you are not connecting with this person like consciously connecting with them because you're trying to figure out who the hell is this you know are they just somebody that came into my life to teach me a lesson or you know are they my person for real i'm not sure at this point but i'm gonna find out okay <clears throat> let's see why this person is not connecting with you because the are fighting it um i feel like right now they're really trying to build up the nerve i feel like this person's afraid at this point because they don't want to fail they don't want to lose okay they're holding themselves back right now because again with the knight of pentacles they are trying to see what is the best way to approach you what do they need to say what do they need to do that sort of thing, okay? Working up the nerve, building up the confidence, strategizing is what I feel like this individual is currently in the process of doing, okay? They've been fighting it, but I feel like now they cannot hold back. So now they're in the process of like really kind of um, coming up with a master plan. All right, guys? So let's see what's currently going on for Pisces. What's currently going on for Pisces? Thinking, thinking, thinking. Thinking about, you know, the fact what you don't want. Okay. So let's not think about what we don't want and think about what we do want. Okay. So what you're thinking about right now is, you know, am I ever going to find anybody or I'm not going to find anybody that I can get along with that sees things the way that I see them, that's going to want to move in the way that I move, you know you're thinking about like the negative things okay so right now you kind of conflicted kind of you know struggling back and forth in your head about knowing what you want knowing what you deserve and if it's actually possible it is possible okay it is possible 
So believe that, guys. All right, so let's see what's currently going on for them. What's currently going on for them? The chariot. Hmm. Moving on. Doing something that they feel like is going to be successful for them. Hmm. Going forward. You're going forward. This person is manifesting success into their life. It's what they're doing here. And they're following a path here. I feel like this is your person, honestly. They're following a path here, is what I'm seeing. Okay. Let's see what's influencing you guys. What is influencing Pisces? And when I say this is your person, I don't mean that you guys will definitely be together because their you know, free will comes into play. All right. But I think that this person, you know, was meant to be in your life probably for the duration. OK, whether or not they will be, you know, that remains to be seen. But I definitely feel like they're following their pa their path and you're looking for yours. OK. And, and I'm getting the feeling that it's leading you to this person or them to you. You guys to each other. What's influencing Pisces? The tower. This breakup. Mm -hmm. Your foundation has been shook. Whether it's within yourself, your thoughts, your beliefs on how things should happen or... Um, could happen your expectations you know all of that stuff is coming into play right now that you guys are thinking about you're thinking about everything that happened with them um, maybe other things that have happened in your life since then or during that time but definitely an awakening an awakening is is what's influencing you some kind of happenings that have have come across as like you know kind of jolting okay <clears throat> hmm. feeling like you failed at something at this connection with this person caught off guard a lot of you felt with disconnecting from this um, this relationship the eight of swords here we go now they're thinking about this very same thing whatever happened between you guys whatever it was that they did wrong here you guys are definitely in a cycle with this person and you've done this dance with this person several times before is what I'm getting here if you see the infinity sign over the magician's head right there, okay? You see the infinity sign right there in strength. The number eight. And then you have the eight of swords. Definitely you've been going around and around and around with this person. And maybe not just in this lifetime, but in, in others as well, okay? There's something that you guys are, are like being brought together to. There's some unfinished business between you and this individual. There's definitely something needs to be wrapped up here. Okay. What's coming in for Pisces? Strength. Hmm. You will clear up all this confusion. You will definitely face um, that devil energy where you feel like, you know, nobody is going to meet you halfway. Nobody's going to be your Mr. Right or Mrs. Right. Um, you will get clear on what it is that you want and know that you can't have it. Okay. You will gain your confidence in yourself 
for sure. And I saw the emperor under the bottom of your deck. And it's still there. You will indeed gain the confidence that you need um, to be successful, whether it's in a relationship, whether it's in a job, but strong relationship is here. I don't see anything about a job here. Um, you guys can and will get what it is that you want and deserve. Believe that, okay? Believe that. Manifest that shit, okay? So what's coming in for them? What is coming in for them? The Empress. I feel like this person is definitely coming towards you. I feel like they are all about growing, all about starting over, um, having everything that they want and feel like they deserve in their life as well. This person may be starting a new business here. Okay, I don't I do not feel like this is about anyone else. No, I do not. I feel like this is all about you. Um, their growth is leading them to you. You to each other. It's like you guys are just like this intertwined. Okay, and threes are all about growth as well. Definitely. Hmm. Let's see what's blocking you. What's blocking Pisces? What did I tell you? The magician. Manifest this shit into fruition manifest it do not let your negative thoughts knock what's supposed to come in for you believe that you can be successful or have a successful relationship with this person even if you want it okay but you've got to manifest it you've got to believe it you've got to do it both of you guys here have it within you to bring this into fruition. Wrap this up. You both have it. I feel like somebody's really been doing some work here. Really and truly, they've been doing some work here. Let's see. What's blocking them? This is not having the confidence, guys. The magician is all about confidence that you can do this shit. Blocking them. The Four of Wands. I feel like this they're too comfortable, is what it is. They're too comfortable, like by themselves. They're in their safe zone here with the Four of Wands. And maybe they have other people like as a buffer so they won't feel so lonely. Maybe they have like a roommate, this person, or is living in the home with like their family. Um, you know, they have entertainment within their home. I don't feel like this person is married or in a relationship. I really don't. They could be. But only if you know that, you know, they definitely could be. Um, but I am not feeling that. I'm feeling like they're just way too comfortable um, you know, in the situation they're in right now and not really trying to step out of that comfort zone. Okay. Yeah. What is the advice for Pisces? What's the advice for Pisces? A lot of them can't get over what happened to the two of you. It's it's um it's still there, and it's still it's on replay. Okay, let's see. Hmm. The advice here is there's two people in this card. And I feel like this is for you guys to basically be there for each other. 
Be there for the people that you love. Regardless. But at the same time, do not accept. Do not accept this type of behavior from anyone anymore. Where you feel that they're not giving you what you need. They're not giving it to you. They're not giving you what you deserve. Do not accept this behavior anymore. When you spot it, um, chuck up the deuces, okay? Be out. Mm -mm. Do not let anyone drain you. The advice for them. What is the advice for them? Seven of Wands here. Hmm. Standing up for what they believe in. Standing up for what they believe in. Maybe this person felt like they got lost in the connection. Um, or did not did not they weren't able to express themselves the way that they you know felt comfortable doing maybe the advice here for them is to not be so defensive to not stay in this comfort zone to come out to allow this energy in to flow back and forth between the two of you because maybe this person does have you guys blocked or they feel like you have them blocked. There is definitely like a blockage here. But I see them, <coughs> excuse me, I see that they have been fighting manifesting this situation, um, holding themselves back here. Thinking about everything that's been done. Whatever happened between the two of you. Very comfortable in the state that they're in right now. So maybe they're not like physically blocking you. You may not have blocked you on social media, anything like that. But their energy is such that it's blocking you. And vice versa, I feel. You know, you guys haven't made it to the Six of Wands yet. They're at the Four of Wands. You're at the Five of Wands. The Six of Wands is not here. Success. Moving forward. Not together anyway. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see what the outcome is here. What is the outcome for Pisces? What is the outcome for Pisces? Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles. You would definitely um, have a relationship, I feel, where somebody is definitely giving you what you give them. There will be reciprocity. You will have that. Somebody wanting to spend just as much time with you as you do with them. I definitely get that. Okay? Because you're not going to allow it. You're not going to allow it. What is the outcome for them? The outcome for them. The Queen of Swords. Hmm. I think this person definitely will speak. I think that... Um, <sighs> they're going to be defensive though. This person is very defensive and I feel like they hide things. I feel like they hide things. So, you know, you guys be careful of that energy if this is a person that, um, if this is a person that you want to be with. Because I definitely get that they, they have the tendency to be angry, to lash out. Okay. And they have the tendency to hide things, to be secretive. 
but they try to make you feel like they're being open and honest with you even if they're lying by omission you know so just be careful of that energy i do see three sevens here now mm -hmm. this person definitely was was put in your path for a reason definitely all right so we have Gem gemini libra aquarius taurus is here aries is here uh leo is here scorpio virgo Hmm. cancer is here all right guys so that's what i have for you and i will be speaking with you guys soon